Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Excuse the fact that I am mid makeup, but today I have something really exciting. So I never did a YouTube video on this eyeshadow palette, the Melanin Fantasy from um, Brown Melanin Makeup, but they're this brand new indie brand that is black owned. And as you can see, I have pan in this shade February because I used it as highlighter non-stop and I loved it. And I also love this shade, which is strong for blush. But anyway, so they um, last week had a launch. So this was their first product. And they had a launch for two setting powders, one in translucent and one in medium deep or dark deep or something like that which this is 14.99 which was a good price i was like i can get behind this and they also launched some new lip glosses which i will soon be picking up because at that point last week i was on a no bite and i broke it for this and then since then i've made two orders so hence why it's half my face is half done because i am testing out these two new revolution launches but anyway I'm really really excited because I have been trying to find a loose powder that I really love and I've just not been able to so I have very high expectations and high hopes because every time I've spoken spoken to the brand owner and everything like that they've been so supportive so kind and um, the eyeshadow palette is amazing so I have massive hopes for this now, without further ado, I'm just going to go in with my favourite Lasting Perfection Concealer. On my face, I'm wearing a mixture of um, CC Cream from IT Cosmetics. I have a mini one of that. And I love mixing it with my Rimmel Match Perfection. I find that, weirdly enough, that's a really good combination. So, let's get into the powder. I'm just going to tip some into the cap. I have the fan on so this could end badly. This is how much we are going to use. I'm going to get a clean sponge and coat that. Let's hope it melts into the skin, doesn't leave streaks and sets the makeup nicely because I will be so happy if this becomes my favourite powder because like I said the brand is so all for people of colour and just so nice and genuine like in general from what I can see on the camera because I'm looking at the viewfinder that looks flawless fingers crossed everything looks alright when I look up close okay I'm actually like so happy that looks so good that's about as much as I can zoom you in but that's just that loose powder that looks flawless I am so happy now I'm gonna take what's left over in the cap which isn't a lot because I use a lot and I'm just gonna press that into the rest of my face oh my god i'm so happy that this powder is actually good and i didn't mention but you get 25 grams of product for 14.99 which is an amazing price like i have been trying for years to find a loose powder that i really really enjoy i've tried hourglass laura mercier rmca like three revolution powders beauty bakery maybelline and the closest that I've come to a good powder is the Hourglass one was alright. Laura Mercier was okay. It didn't set. Like it didn't last very long. That I get to genuinely support a black owned really indie brand. And like genuinely love the product. So I might actually. Oh no the lip gloss is sold out. So I can't even go and get them now. That's made me sad. But as soon as they are back in stock, I am grabbing them. Anyway, I'm going to go finish the rest of my makeup and I will be back with my final thoughts, even though you kind of already know my thoughts of it. And now we get to finish this review. I've just finished. I'm doing three videos at once. It's a bit complicated. So 
no surprise here, but I would give the new Brown Melon Makeup Loose Setting Powder a 10 out of 10. Like, I looked at it really close up. Now you see how it looks on camera and stuff like that, which can sometimes be deceiving. I really like the way this looks. It's... Oh, I love it. I put it all over my face as well before setting it with my um, pressed powder. And I am just really excited to use this. And I don't get that kind of excited from loose powders because none of them have like ever wowed me and stuff like that. So this one gets a 10 out of 10. You should check this one out definitely. Um, it's only 14 99 and they have free standard shipping, I'm pretty sure. Um, and their eyeshadow palette is... £21 I'm pretty sure um, and the pans are huge so I definitely need to do a get ready with me with this palette um, let me know if you guys want to see that this is definitely my favourite powder probably that I've tried ever um, and yeah like I said that makes me really excited because it's a good brand to support so thank you guys for watching this short video I hope it was helpful and leave me some suggestions below what other videos you would like to see. Do you like more reviews, more project pans, get ready with me's? So let me know and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.